Hi everyone, I'm Britannia. Thank you for joining me today. I'm going to be talking to you a little bit about mediumship and what it is. Um, I'm a very gifted person. I've been very lucky as well to have had this handed down to me. I come from many generations of people with the gift or gifts as I call it. Um, and I've been giving readings for over 30 years, helping people in other ways as well with my gifts um, and enjoying it as well while I do it. Um, but like I say, I've done many readings and I've known since I was a very small child that I had the gift seeing and hearing spirit um that is basically mediumship being sensitive enough to hear outer forces if you like spirits because i work with the angelic realms as well um so i hear quite a lot of uh of beings if you like and you're a i'm able to hear them see them and bring messages to uh the people i'm giving readings from they're for a member of their family etc i mean you do have people that uh, turn up might be an old neighbor and things like that you know that come in to say hello but being able to receive these messages hear them uh, i hear them like i'm speaking to a normal person i see them like i'm i'm seeing a normal person in the in the physical you know uh, so i am very directed in hearing what i'm hearing and passing that message on to whoever i'm doing the reading for um so being a medium is also in understanding that there is no death uh, it's just a body that dies and we go home so there is no death so I'm actually yeah I'm speaking to somebody that's passed and they've gone to the heaven plane but they're still alive but they're just in spirit form and that is why people like myself mediums are able to converse with that spirit because they're not exactly dead it's just the the physical body's died and they've left this plane uh, and it's as simple as that so yes I'm able to have that person for the reading and to be able to bring whoever it may be uh, to them and pass on the messages it can be about all sorts of things um and you know that just is basically i think what medium mediumship is receiving uh information uh through pictures through hearing as well uh smelling uh, the mediumistic senses, I have all of them. I don't want to confuse you with that, but there there are senses that we, that we all possess, I believe, intuitiveness it being another sense as well, a clear knowing, you know, clear cognizance. Um, but all these come together in me being able to converse with spirit and, yeah, speak speak to to them for for the person who... the the messages are for it's as simple as that i mean some people are like really and i know some people think it's like you know you know there is charlatans out there but us good ones who do converse hands on that that is what mediumship is being able to see and and speak to a spirit force like i say i work the angelic realms as well so i'm what i speak to them as well and they i hear them as clearly as i do a physical person um and they help me no end with all sorts of things uh, and i love it my spirit family come in and i converse with them and they help me as well you know which is good even silly things like you know where to go and get a car tire from and stuff like that and where where i've lost my keys because i'm good at losing them so the spirit realms help you with many things so being a medium is just hearing and seeing and having maybe mini movies played out as well um and yeah being able to smell things receive um astral flowers feathers from them so all that is part of when you do a reading you can pass that on to the person you're doing the reading for and usually uh, i have a good time with with the people i'm giving readings for because it's usually quite fun it can be quite fun what people have got to say there's nothing ever bad because that's not what we're all about and i don't want to know it and i certainly wouldn't want to pass it on to anyone else you know um they can keep that so i don't ever get uh, bad information or think stuff like that because i don't want it and nor does the person i'm giving the reading to so uh but normally nine times out of ten there's not anything really bad to say anyway which is wonderful and uh, we have a joyful reading when i'm giving the reading 
reading and um, that's what it's all about. It's all about enjoying it. There's no hocus pocus to it. It's just plain old simple speaking to spirit that aren't in the physical anymore and who've gone to the heaven plane and want to just come in and say hi to the person I'm giving the reading for and usually send in lots of love. And my readings are, yeah, very light-hearted, lovely, nothing too heavy. Um, and I'm very honoured to do them, you know, I'm very honoured to have this gift. And uh, I feel very lucky to uh, be able to, to be able to read energy, you know, and feel them, see them through my, my third eye. And uh, yeah, I just feel very, very lucky for that gift. Like I say, it's been handed down through generations of my family. Seven, I can take it back to. Um, so yeah, very honoured. Always a lady as well. But yeah, that kind of how mediumship is, receiving information from the other realms, but in different forms. You know, like I say, hearing, seeing, um, mini movies as well, smelling. You know, there's some of the senses without going too deep with you and too confusing. Because otherwise, if I really went into it, people would be like, I don't really understand. Because if you're not that way, you're not going to get it. So I've just tried to give it to you in layman's terms. So yes, I have been giving, read giving readings for over 30 years. Um, and all over the world, I can do it uh, when I'm sat next to you. Or I can do it over the phone, Zoom. Skype or uh, Facebook Messenger. Uh, I do. I can do emails as long as uh, someone gives you the correct name. It does help it, uh, because if they don't give you the correct name, it can just hold you up a little bit, you know, in like getting their energy to me because we are all connected. But if I have the right name, I can help that energy be brought to me a lot quicker. So uh, it's easier for me. It's less time wasting, you know. So. Um, yes, that's, that's, you know, what I've been doing th for, for, for a long time. And like I say, I really, really enjoy, uh, giving readings to people and I try and be as, yeah, fun as I possibly can and not too, you know, serious, like I say. Um, but yeah, I've been doing it for over 30 years and enjoy it immensely. And I do it all over the world. I've got to tell you, I give readings weekly, uh, all over the world. Doesn't matter where you are, as long as I can like say to you, speak to you, I can uh, give you a reading. It's not a problem. I don't have to be in the same room as you to give you a true reading. So that that's another good thing because we are all connected, you know. Um, so basically, guys, if you would like a reading with me, and um, oh, I'd like to think you would, um, you can have a reading with Britannia and uh, just basically thanks for listening to me I hope I've kind of helped you understand in layman terms about mediumship how it works um, and not too heavy because sometimes like I say I, I do teach as well and people don't always get it you know when you start talking about everything as energy we are energy and I'm just reading that energy which I am and we are all connected um, and when I'm doing a reading, I'm literally reading someone's energy and then I have usually have a spirit come in and then that, you know, then I'm conversing direct one on one with the spirit. That's how I do my readings normally. So it's as simple as that. I don't always use cards, don't need to, to be honest. I know other people like to use tools as in Oracle or tarots, don't need them, to be honest. Um, so they're, yeah. If I, use, I get stuck, if I get stuck, I use them, so open someone's energy sometimes, but no, I don't always use tarot. It's just literally me reading your energy and one-on-one -on -one with whoever's out there that wants to connect to you through me and has got messages to say. So basically, yes, if you'd like a reading, thank you ever so much for listening to me for nine minutes. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you'd like a reading, I'd be more than honoured to give you one. Okay, thank you guys. Love and light you. Bye. Bye.